A Makiki family is mourning the loss of their 10-year-old daughter who died this morning after falling from an apartment building stairwell. Ron Mizutani joins us with more. Ron. Joe, police are still trying to determine what floor she fell from and, more importantly, what caused her to fall. Emergency crews were called to the Crown Thurston apartment just after 7.30 Monday morning. And then we heard, you know, her scream. It's a woman's voice. When my great-grandson said, what's that? Somebody fell down. Residents say they don't know who screamed. But moments later, they found a young girl lying motionless in a grassy area. On the first floor where the uh, victim was found is a, like a rec recreation center or recreation open area. And she was found just a few feet from the, from the stairs. It just happened so fast that, you know, we didn't, I, I didn't know I was, who, what, did, what had happened. We heard the ambulance and then the police cars. The 10-year-old girl was taken to the hospital in critical condition. She was pronounced dead at 8-11. Relatives say the victim's parents were at home at the time. We're still trying to determine what, you know, what caused the uh, fall. Uh, we haven't determined that yet. Police say it's unclear what floor the girl fell from, although they focused a portion of their investigation on the fourth floor, where it was marked by yellow tape. The staircase has four feet high railings. For us to, you know, hear that kind of uh, incident, it's scary. Residents say the victim has a younger sibling. Her family requested their privacy. I'm sure they're very distraught at this point. Uh, this young girl, 10 years old, uh, and anytime somebody, you know, you lose a young child, I'm sure the parents are, are very, uh, are hurting inside. I feel sorry for, you know, the family. And several people said the staircase of the 11-story building is seldom used by residents, mainly during emergencies. Ron Mizutani, KHON 2 News.